What's up, guys? Just when you think you've seen it all, another day and another day of drone activity. People are seeing lights now flashing in parking lots, cars in parking lots flashing without alarms going off. You guys are going to see video footage of very tall stadium lights flashing very rapidly for, for unknown reasons. I mean, people are really freaked out by what's going on. I don't know if these flashing lights are related to the mysterious drone activity, but I will say this. Here recently, Recently, there's an article over here at Newsweek.com. People that have sent drones up towards these mystery drones trying to get a look at what these things are, their batteries lost power. I did a video about people telling their stories, how they had brand new batteries. They, they sent their drones up. And these folks that had these issues with their batteries have a lot of experience flying drones. And they've never had this happen. Their batteries would not hold a charge. And again, they were using fresh batteries to go up and kind of get a look at what's going on in the sky. Not only above New Jersey, but New York, Connecticut, Florida. You guys are going to see some exceptional video footage. I mean, really wild stuff. And here's another theory that's came out here in the last two or three days over here at Newsweek.com. goes on to say mystery drones could be trying to find radioactive material. Aerospace CEO, article dated December 16th of, of 2024, goes on to say reported drone sightings across New York and New Jersey could be due to potential gas leaks or, or radioactive material. Reports of mystery drone sightings in multiple states have drawn widespread attention with the majority of these reports being at night and the majority of the video footage that I've received from from people from all across the country the majority of those videos are at night here's a folder of just some of the videos that I've received in the last 48 hours I've got many many more that I'm currently working on look at all these videos Angie Cassidy Brandon Christopher Glenn James Joey John Mr. Bailey, Michael, Renee, I mean, it just goes on and on and on and on and on. People are seeing these things all across the country and quite possibly in other countries. Here recently there was a, an incident involving planes. This was last week on Wednesday and Thursday in a 24-hour period. There were two airplanes, one in New York and one in the, the state of Texas, in Victoria, Texas, that had to land on a highway for unknown reasons. Again, both of these incidents occurring within 24 hours of each other. I'm not saying these incidents were necessarily related to the drone activity, but that is highly mysterious to have two planes land on highways within 24 hours of each other. In this next video, you're going to hear an eerie conversation between an airplane pilot and a control tower down here at the Patterson, the Wright-Patterson Airfield Base near Dayton, Ohio. And here's the video footage and the narration. Mid-flight is better sent tower. Use extreme caution for heavy UAS uh, movement on the base. Security forces is handling the situation. Suggest that or above uh, 1,700 AGL. That we will maintain 2,000 uh, on our transition for my flight. And I got to keep the lights down so that security forces can see. Roger that, no problem. As you heard there, the control tower was warning the pilot to use extreme caution due to heavy unauthorized UAS activity. UAS stands for Unmanned Aircraft System. 
another name for a drone. And this all occurred in central Ohio. And as you heard ground control tell the pilot to use extreme caution, that once he got through the area using extreme caution, they were going to sanitize the air. I'm assuming that means they were going to go up and maybe remove these drones from the sky. I'm not quite sure. I've, I've never heard that term used. And as I mentioned at the beginning of the video about these mysterious flashing street lights and basically an entire parking lot of cars, the, the lights, the hazard lights were all flashing for unknown reasons. Robert, video out of Tampa, St. Petersburg, Florida, 1215 of 2024, last night. Check this out. Look at these lights along the sidewalk flashing for unknown reasons. He'd never seen that before. Here's video number two. Same situation. Griselda Rivera out of Harlington, Texas, 1215 of 2024. This occurred last night. This video has narration. Here we go. They had absolutely no clue what was happening here. And notice the street lights, these very tall 30, 35 foot street lights flashing mysteriously for unknown reasons. They had never seen that. And it was just certain lights, not all of the lights in the area, just certain lights. Notice how they're flashing. See that? Unbelievable. Oh, this gets better. You're gonna see even more examples of this. Here's video number three of a collection of videos that I put together. Skylar, also 1215 of 2024. Notice the lights flashing very, very rapidly. Those are street lights flashing for mysterious unknown reasons. Check this out, video number four. This is a series of videos that I put together of the dozens that have been coming in. Naperville, Illinois, Courtney Range. Once again, 1215 of 2024. Was there some sort of an EMP last night that was interfering with electricity and the, the, the flow of electricity? Look at these cars in this parking lot. The hazard lights are flashing on the majority of the cars sitting in this parking lot, but no alarms. Just the lights flashing. What? How is that happening? Unbelievable. Here's video number five. Danielle Brubaker from Hamilton Lake, New Jersey. Noticed a string of lights in the nighttime sky, and they were moving very quickly, kind of randomly. This is not a, a Starlink satellite train. You're going to see something that, that looks like a Starlink satellite train here in just a minute. But you're going to see a very bright flash here coming up in just a couple of seconds. A very overwhelmingly bright flash of light. Something happens right here in the sky above this lake. What these things are is a mystery. I don't know if these are drones. They almost have to be some kind of a drone, right? They appear to be under intelligent control. Right there is the flash. And you're going to see the aftermath right there. Look at that. Are you serious right now? Again, this is above New Jersey. What is going on? Wow, and then there was one light left remaining in the sky. And here's video number six. Check this out. What in the world? Drone, UFO, large, mysterious black craft flying through the sky. That almost looks like a stealth plane. A very close view of a possible stealth plane. Coming up in this next video, video number seven, this video has narration. You're going to see a drone fall from the sky from about 1,500 feet. Check this out, it has narration. Here we go. Something's going up real fast. A plane? I can't tell what it is. Oh, is that moving quick? That could be a drone. I don't know what the hell that is. But that is quick. There's only one remaining right now. The green flash and one as he moved quick around it to get it. Hey, watch what happens. Super quick. He's 
just like right there with it. Ooh, he's like right on it. Ooh, 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 ooh. That whatever it was just shut down the drum. Everything was a drum. Are you serious right now? Video by Court from 1214 of 2024, just a couple of nights ago. Here's video number eight sent in by Angela, November 18th of 2024 at 4.55 a.m. This looks to be mimicking a Starlink satellite train. We've all by now seen Starlink satellite trains, right? Moving through the nighttime sky, either in person or in video format. I know I've shared a lot of videos of the Starlink satellite trains. This appears to be semi-stationary. There's a collection of, of lights you can clearly see in the sky. Again, this was at around 5 o'clock in the morning, but they don't appear to be moving. If they are moving, they're moving incredibly slow. And usually, a Starlink satellite train moves relatively quickly through the nighttime sky. Not slow like this. I mean, this is practically stalled. But it does look like a Starlink satellite train. So I'm wondering if these drones are mimicking a Starlink here in this particular situation. I'm not sure of the location. I'm waiting to hear back from Angela on the location that she saw these things in the early morning sky. But there was a very long string of lights in a perfectly straight line at a steep angle moving through the sky above her location appearing to be a Starlink satellite train, but barely moving. Barely moving. And I've seen two myself in person, and I've seen probably dozens of videos, to be honest, and they're usually moving pretty quickly. Not super fast, but much faster than what we've got here. I mean, it's hard to tell if these things are even moving. I mean, are these drones mimicking a Starlink satellite train? I have no idea, but it's not behaving like a normal Starlink satellite train would. It's moving way, way too slow to the point where it almost looked stationary at one time. Once again, video footage sent in by Angela. Here's video number nine of probably a hundred that I've received here recently. Sent in by Kevin from 1215 of 2024 at 630 a.m. Yesterday morning, he looked up and saw this in the early morning sky. This was white and blue moving horizontally across the sky. Not an airplane, not a helicopter, very bright light. Probably some sort of a drone above Maryland. Once again, he noticed that at 6.30 in the morning. It appeared to be bright white and had a blue color to it, as you can see right there. See the blue? Definitely not an airplane, definitely not a helicopter. It wasn't making any sound at all. Here's video number 10 sent in by Craig out of Sunapee, New Hampshire. From the night of 12 14 of 2024 they were watching this and i say it because there's multiple witnesses here and there's some brief narration they were filming that whatever that thing is and there was another stationary light up here to the the upper right at around the one two o'clock position you'll see it here in just a second right there it is craig stop i'm recording okay this uh, young lady's trying to record and you're going to see a red and white what appears to be a drone enter the field of view. I think that's what she was waiting on there. I got it. I think she saw it. She was waiting for it to come back and she actually got it. Here I put it in slow motion. Looks like another one of those big red and white drones that people have been seeing all up and down the East Coast and New Hampshire where this video is from. And I also have two videos from the West Coast of what looked to be the same exact object. Here's an interesting statement from President-elect Trump regarding the drone situation, uh, specifically in New Jersey. Check this out. Can you comment on the drones that are flying around yeah. New Jersey ports? It seems like the American people have a big distance. The, gover the government knows what is happening. Um, look, our military knows where they took off from. If it's a garage, they can go right into that garage. They know where it came from and where it went. And for some reason, they don't want to comment. And I think they'd be better off saying what it is. Our military knows and our, our president knows. And for some reason, they want to keep people in suspense. I can't imagine it's the enemy because it was the enemy that blasted out. Even if they were late, they blasted. Uh, something strange is going on. For some reason, they don't want to tell the people. And they should because the people are really, I mean, they happen to be over Bedminster. We one should another have always seen well, they're very, they're very close to Bedminster. I think maybe I won't spend the weekend in Bedminster. I've, I've decided to cancel my trip. Have you 
received an intelligence briefing on the drones? I don't want to comment on that. Have you? Bedminster is in northern New Jersey. He was talking about this location right here. And there has been a ton of drone activity in that location. So interesting remarks from President-elect Trump. So the drone drama continues. Now we have streetlights, large and small, like you see right here, flashing, pulsing for unknown reasons. These are three examples. This is out of St. Petersburg, Tampa, Florida, and I received two other locations. I believe one was out of Texas of large, like parking lot lights, pulsing for unknown reasons. Things are starting to get very, very interesting. Thanks for watching, have a super day, and be safe out there.